Today's show is Renata Strang, Elfenfreundin, and we're going to talk about elves and her books and other things you are thoroughly going to enjoy. Here is her book, Elfen, Götter and Feuergeister, which means uh, uh, elves, uh, gods, and fire ghosts. Conversations with a different world. Another book of hers is called Bomb Fantasien. It means tree fantasy and it is mirrored photos with text and poems. Beautiful book. It's a visit with a person of high strangeness and, um, this is my friend, Renata Strang. Now, I want to talk to you about this interview here. Um, we're going to attempt to do it bilingual, but that doesn't mean that's how it's going to work out. And um, I'm the little person here in the, in the corner. Let me show you here. It, this is a Skype, this is a Skype um, interview. So you see, so... This would be me waving at you, and I'm the one in the hat, and of course I'm smoking, so we're going to meet Renata Strong today, and uh, so how are you, Renata? Thank you. I'm very well. And tell me where you live. I, I'm living in Germany, and at the moment I'm with my sister mm -hmm. in Kirchdinten, that's South of Bremen. I understood from right, Bremen. And North of Bremen, yeah. And normally, what's the other name of the town you live? Kirchlinten. Okay. At the moment. And I'm living at Wiesel <laughs> She said that really good because you know what? <laughs> I, <laughs> I can't see that one. So, in the, in the meantime, in the meantime, what I'm going to do is, so they understand what we're going to talk about, I'm going to show them some of your pictures. Would you mind? No, that's okay. So, yeah, so we're going to show you some pictures, and, uh, well, let's talk about the books there for a minute. But by you seeing the pictures, you'll understand what it is uh, we're trying to, uh, we're trying to explain to you. Now, Renata. Do you remember how we met? Yes, I remember. I learned Rosie. Rosie Margot. Mm -hmm. You know? <laughs> okay, yes. And uh, Rosie was at your show. Uh -huh. And you showed my pictures. And after that, we uh, learned <laughs> which other. We talked every day, and now we say. Actually, we were talking to one another before Facebook because I used to call you. Yeah. Yeah. So that's how we got there. And then uh, in the meantime, Renato wrote these beautiful books. So um, if you get a pencil and a paper, her website is on that clip. And the music that uh, is accompanying it is by Fritz Meyer. That's the gentleman you met a couple of weeks ago. He's also one of our friends. So here we go. Um, Enjoy some of uh, Renata's work.
That was fun. I hope you liked my selection. I hope it. I, I think I will, I will love it. You love it. Yeah, Renata hasn't seen the show yet, so we, we, we are assuming. Now, please tell me, growing up, have you always been intuitive? Um, it's, I've been intuitive when I was a children, when I was a child, but my family said you are mad and how children hear it from everybody, and so I lost it. Oh, you lost but it? Yeah. I lost it for, for many, many years, but in 2004, I met a woman, and with her, all it it came back. Mm -hmm. Was talking to her and with our connection, all it, all it came back. She is a magician. A magician. A witch. Oh, okay. And, and and so did you? And you took up photography after that or before that? Oh, I didn't understand. Sorry. Hast du als Fotografin Sachen gemacht, ehe du die Frau kennengelernt hast oder später? Yes. I took photos, uh, fairy photos before I oh, before met this woman. Before you, before you met her, yeah. Oh. But this woman, she opened my eyes. Uh huh. So, yeah. 2004, that's a long time ago, huh? Yes. And you're working on book? Three. I I'm working. I, I I did write two books, and I'm working on three new ones. <laughs> oh, three all at the same time. Yes, yes. She's, she's a lot better than me. I have to do one at a time. <laughs> yeah, one one at the, one at a time. So I yes, want one. Yes. Yeah. So so I want to. I have to tell you a story here because. Renata asked me to translate one of the books, one of the new ones that's coming. Well, as you know, I don't speak any German, period. So I thought, well, you know, maybe I can try to relearn it. So I started watching soap operas and movies and things. And next thing you know, I'm speaking German again, and that's the only reason we can do this. So thank you. <laughs> In gathering of someone, your pictures and your materials, how do you go about doing that? Uh, when I take pictures, I do see a lot in, the, in nature. I see tree beings and stone beings, and I take pictures of them. And sometimes I see fairies, and I can take pictures. And sometimes they are on my pictures without without I have seen them. Mm hmm it, They want to be photographed. That happens a lot when uh, when we come home or uh, myself if we take a video and we don't see it, but when you when you check it, there it is. Yeah. We're not, yes. By the way, all of Renata's pictures are copyrighted. So if you want to use any of them, you, would you please ask for her permission or something, no? Yes, I, I will give, give permission. Yeah. And so, so you wrote the first book that was Guy's Day, yeah? My first book was this one. Elfen Götter Feuergeister. Okay. And, and we showed you a picture of that, and that is, talks about fire, uh, Fire. Fire beings. Fire beings. What, what, do, what are they like? Do you know? Uh, fire. They, they live in the spirit world, and they. Uh, uh, English. They live in the fire, and they make the fire. Uh, there are two kinds of fire. Fires uh, who want the, the God wants, and fires the bad ones. Okay, so so we we have a good and bad. That in that is, uh, so they influence by either one side, 
just like everything else to keep the balance? Is that yes, it? Yes. And the, the fire of the good one, of Mother Earth, the fire being uh, stopped when Mother Earth says as a stop, but when the evil makes the fire, the fire being cannot be stopped. Mm -hmm. you, you, you can say it in German if you have to. I can translate a little bit. Yes. Also die Feuergeister, es gibt die großen, entwickelten Feuergeister und es gibt die kleinen, die so wild sind, dass sie nicht gestoppt werden können. Okay. Uh, in, in essence, what she said, some of them are... Highly developed. Very well developed. Um, are you also talking about, intel are they intelligent beings? I mean, yes? Yes. Yeah. yeah. And, and then I would think the others she's referring to, like, um, in elemental, maybe? Elemental is something else. Elemental. Uh, so, so see what I know. All right. So, uh, and then in, in your book you explain things, or is that the one with the poems? Huh? Is that what, sind da Geschichten drin, oder hast du da auch Gedichte drin? In this, uh, da sind nur meine Reisen drin, Reisenprotokolle. Ich war doch in der geistigen Welt. Okay, now I now I have it. In it, with this particular book, she traveled into the worlds of those beings and came back with information, and that's the one with with the with the uh, fire beings. And um, beautiful pictures and everything. Then the next book is called. Baumfantasien. Uh, a bisschen höher, ein Moment. Just up a little bit. Wonderful. Got to find their stop. Okay, fine. Thank you. That is the one, that's the one, a copy found its way to the University of Texas um, a few months ago. Okay. Yes. What is that book about? The book is about tree beings. Tree beings. I took, I took photos and then eagles. Mm -hmm. She mirrored the photos, but uh, I don't know what they consist of. I'm assuming it, it's it's a it's a photography art that I know absolutely nothing about, but it's called mirrored photography. And und durch das Spiegeln werden die Wesen in den Bäumen sichtbarer. Oh, and be because of the mirroring. Um, you, whatever, whatever is living in, in the tree, in the tree or in, in the nature world is a lot more visible. I show a picture. Oh. Okay, stop. Yeah, right there. That is a mirrored picture. Das habe ich sogar drauf gemacht. That's one that you see yeah. already. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It, it, it's just a wonderful book. If you don't understand the word in German, it doesn't really matter. It is just wonderful, you know. Thank you, everyone. Yeah. And, and you, are you working on three more, right? Yes. One book about my voyages into the spirit world. The, about her travels into the spirit world? I met interesting beings, very interesting beings. Mm -hmm. We have a book about fairies. How we are, how they really are. Mm -hmm. And the third book, one again, once again, mirrored pictures about stone. Stone mirrored stone. pictures. That will be interesting. Yeah. Um. So tell me. <laughs> oh, excuse me. The seasons are changing. It's really crazy. We have summer and winter and autumn all at the same time. So we all coughing and hacking and. And so, uh, you have a new companion. His name is Yoshi. Yes, my dear one. Um, Yoshi is the dog that I showed you, and he goes with you on your trips. Always, and he is so calm when I take photos. When I take photos, and some things, sometimes he sees, he sees things I don't see, mm -hmm. and when 
I take a photo, there is a curry on it. Oh, so in other words, like, like you know, uh, I guess he perceives things and she points. That happens a lot with animals. Yes. Mm -hmm. And you rescued him? Is that it? He has been in the shelter and I rescued him, yes. That's a rescue. One year ago. Mm -hmm. And I love him very, very much. Yeah. So he's a rescue dog that is helping. Um, let's see. In your travels into the spirit world there, we have maybe eight minutes to tell that. Uh, can you can you give us a story? Yes. I first, also, ich entspanne erst tief. First she relaxes. Very deep, and then, uh, dann bin ich vor einer Höhle. Ich gehe durch eine Höhle. Then, then she enters the cave, theoretically, no? Also, gedenklich, ne? Ja. So, so it, mentally she enters the cave. Okay, I got it. I'm sorry. And this, that, this is the portal, or that, that is the tour to another way, to the geistigen way. Mm -hmm. So that would be the portal to a, a, a different real, a different world. Mm -hmm. Also, manchmal werde ich schon in der Höhle von den Bösen überfallen. Mm -hmm. Uh, sometimes she has challenges immediately because some of the dark forces are trying to prevent her from entering. Yeah, sie möchte nicht, dass ich gewisse, gewisse Wesen besuche. Mm -hmm. They sort of object to her talking to some of the, some of the beings. Okay. Aber ich habe immer Helfer und ich, habe, ich schaffe es immer, da durchzukommen. Yeah, but some kind of way she is always... Uh, uh, going, a, going ahead and it always works for her. Yeah, she has a helper, that is Merlin. She has a helper named Merlin. A Moria. Moria? A Moria. Mm hmm Then my fairy sister. A fairy sister. I'm a fee. A fee, a fee, I don't know what a fee is exactly, but a fee is sort of Sort of like a fairy? Yes. It's something. It's something else, but it's similar to a fairy. I don't know how to translate that, okay? And a guardian angel. And a guardian angel. Yes. And these are my friends who accompany me on my travels. Mm -hmm. And my, my, my craft here, I'm there. Oh, so she, she, ha she has a power animal that also accompanies her, which is a bear. Yes. Yeah. Rummel. Uh, uh, what kind of? Brummel. Its name is Brummel. Oh, its name is Brummel. I thought it was a, a Brummel bear. Or oh, name's Brummel. Okay, now I got it. And when I leave the cave, I most in a, also bin ich meistens in einer Wüste. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, you see, when, when she comes out of the cave, she finds herself in a desert-like setting. Und ich weiß nicht, was mich erwartet. And she has no idea what's ahead. Ja, dann kommen meine Freunde, wenn sie nicht schon vorher da waren, um mir zu helfen. So, her, the friends come, and unless they're already present to come and guide her and protect her. Ja, und dann kommen... Wesen, die mich dorthin bringen, wo ich erwartet werde. And then beings come and take and take her where she's expected for. Ja, und her. der Weg dahin ist auch mit sehr vielen Schwierigkeiten auch verbunden. Mm -hmm. And and it, she said it's quite uh, a lot of obstacles until she gets to the final destination. Ja, und wenn ich dann angekommen bin. Dann wurde ich bis jetzt immer von den obersten der Wesen empfangen, von den Königen, Königinnen, mm -hmm. Chiefs. So up, up, up on arrival, someone is there to greet her, they usually people in, uh, you know, beings in high places. Ja, und dann führe ich die Gespräche. And then she can uh, some kind of way tune into this to hear what the conversation is like. Und ich war bei Naturwesen, Nature Spirit. And, and she does the same thing with nature spirits? With God. With who? With God. Oh, God. God. oh, 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 uh, 
um, gods, yeah. Oder, ich weiß nicht, Götter. God, with, with godlike being. I don't know how to translate that exactly, but it would be um, ancients, like ancient gods type. Say, type oh, yes. Yeah. And I talk to angels. And she talks, angels. And she talks to angels and archangels. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Und da bekomme ich die Informationen, die ich dann in den Büchern veröffentliche. And it, it is that that is how she gets her information. That in turn she puts into the books and um, and then and then publishes. Yeah, it's, it's really um, really really interesting. Ja, die Hauptbotschaft ist eigentlich rettet die Erde. And the main the main message is to look out for the Earth and take care of it and try to try to save the Earth mainly. Save the Earth. Mm -hmm. And we can do it together, nature, spirit, and people, and men. Mm. Yeah. Now, uh, here shortly, uh, we, uh, I'm going to play one of um, a Fritz Meyer's video, and, uh, uh, because I didn't know how this interview was going to go. So one that I picked was... Um, I think it's called Crystal, Crystal Clouds or something, um, because even though he's a musician, but he also visualizes what the Earth could look like, and um, and I think it's really kind of fitting that we put that video in here and kind of play some music for you for uh, for a little while, and then uh, I guess we're gonna talk about the other book a little more. And um, I know I sound really strange today. I'm trying to concentrate. Let's see here. <laughs>
and okay. and then make a little music and we're gonna take us a cigarette break because yeah. my tape is getting ready to run out and then um then we'll talk people stuff, huh? Talk people stuff? Okay, so okay. Get me out on ya. Cool. You see, that's what I look like in that little corner there. So I made it kind of big for you. Back to Renata. It's actually kind of it's actually kind of funny because I remembered when I first started doing these shows, I talked slow so you could get used to my um, to my accent. <laughs> and I'm speaking slow so people can understand me. Um, this Skype thing is a new thing for me, and uh, because I can't get around so well anymore, so this is how we do this. And you see, if I can get a little bigger here, that is so funny. I mean, not funny, ha-ha, but it's really working out good. And so Renata, she's going to be back any minute. As, yeah. you, as you can see, we're still smoking. So I just want to let you know... That's why I'm talking so slow, so you understand everything that she's saying, and of course I have to speak slow too. So Renata, can you can you describe to me what it looks like where you live? Yes, I'm living in Mauern, Germany, and as as on Rand der Heide. A Heide would be like a, a high desert type thing, yeah. And it's beautiful there. Mm-hmm. Es ist wunderschön da. I love the sea, also the lake. Mm -hmm. I love the forest. And everything, and it's all, this is alles da. Okay, well, I'm mistaken. It's not high desert since she has lakes and everything. So which would kind of go along with the second video we're going to show you. And so it's time for me to change the tape. And so we'll be right back. Um, we're not okay. Yes, okay. So we hope that you <coughs> enjoyed um, Fred Meyer's uh, music. And we trying to coax Yoshi over there so he can... Yoshi! Yoshi, oh, yeah. He doesn't want to oh, be on yeah. TV, Renata. Um, <laughs> yes, he is. There he is. Oh, <laughs> how sweet. Thank you. He says, get me out of here. How cute is that? <laughs> now, Renata... I understand you're going to be on CDF, that's a major television station, n this weekend, no? Yes, the tour zone. And you're going to talk about what? About uh, nature spirits mm -hmm. and God and faith. Mm -hmm. but is there, is, is it a... Is it a, if, if, uh, is there a besondere Tag or is there an, or, or, or is this nur so, uh, is, hat das mit, dem, mit, mit Nachrichten zu tun oder so, bitte? Nein, das ist einfach nur so ein Thema dieser Sendung. Glaube, Wunder, Religion. Okay, the, the program has to do with religion and uh, miracles and, and, and faith, so. That's really wonderful that they're doing that for you. Yeah, so. You've been, you lived in Germany all your life? Yes. Mm -hmm. all, always in northern Germany. Mm -hmm. I've, I've never been there. Well, no, not true. I've been to Bremen, Hamburg, Lübeck. That's northern, no? Yes. Mm -hmm. I know all the cities. Mm hmm and and you promised to come and visit Washington State. Yes, I will do next year, no? Perhaps. Yeah, I'm getting old. You have to hurry up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm. I'm. Ich werde auch alt. I'm becoming old too. Yeah. Well, you you know the world. The world is a crazy place. We can't. Yeah. We can't plan anything. You know, from one day to the next, because we don't know what's happening. That's true. Yeah. 
uh, as we as we speak here um we don't even have a government so we don't know what we're going to have next year you know <laughs> what i mean we have a government you have a government i'm envious yes so, bin neidisch, du hast eine Regierung. <laughs> da hast diese Regierung, naja. Naja, that's all we can say about that means. Naja. <laughs> Self-explanatory. You have a hobby? Yes. My hobby is my dog and my photos. Taking photos and reading. Mm -hmm. I don't have a hobby. I don't have time. <laughs> sleep. I think I like I like sleeping a whole lot. Yeah. Mhm. Mm and my hobby is also the nature spirit. It's just spirits now. They are my life. Okay. Uh. You. You as the viewers are really familiar with with uh when I ask people about when they are in charge of the world. And I'm going to put the same question to her in German to see uh, how she's going to answer it. So here it comes. Also, you are in charge of the world. What are you going to do? Also, du bist jetzt, also du bist jetzt der Einzige, der was im Universum sah, also in der Welt sagen kann. Die müssen alles machen, was du sagst. Was würdest du denen sagen, dass sie jetzt machen sollen? Wenn nicht mit alle Waffen und hört auf, Mutter Erde auszubeuten. Mm -hmm. She said, do away with all nuclear weapons and quit exploiting the planet. Mm -hmm. All weapons. All we oh, all weapons. Entschuldigung. Excuse me. All weapons, she said. Get rid of all weapons and... Uh, and um that's a good one mm -hmm. I, I think we're gonna play another fritz meyer uh, it has beautiful it's a beautiful video it has trees and and says and uh, which means lakes and things like that and we put that in there and then we'll be back in a few minutes now okay. <laughs>
So that was nice. I, I really liked that. What is your plans for the future? Uh, I am writing books and I want the nature spirit to be become a part of manhood to save the earth. Mm -hmm. yep. And I talk about them and help people accept they are not alone on this planet. Sommer, please, please. Also ich versuche die Naturwesen den Menschen näher zu bringen, damit sie begreifen, dass sie nicht allein auf diesem Planeten sind. Okay. I got it this time. In, in essence, what she said, she's trying to introduce all those, those all those beings to mankind, and at the same time let let them them meaning all the beings she talks to let them know that they not the only that they won't be alone on the planet that we will come to their aid and vice versa. And I think that's a wonderful thought. Yeah, and. Yeah, I dass wir wieder mehr Achtsamkeit gegenüber der Natur und Mutter Erde lernen. Es ist wirklich schrecklich. Es ist wirklich schrecklich. Du hast die Fracking, du hast all die gleichen Probleme, die wir haben in Amerika. Ja, das ist wirklich schrecklich. Ja, das ist wirklich, wirklich schrecklich. Ich ging nach Essen einmal hin. And that is, uh, it was cold and stank and, you know, but it's a lot worse now. Yeah. Yeah, but you now know. It's better, now it's better, now it's Essen because it's gibt kein Kohlewerk for me. Oh, they, they have, they have no, no coal anymore. That's good to know. Alternative, alternative heat, uh, not heat, alternative, um, oh, help me. <laughs> oh, God, that's, that's, uh, uh, uh Fuel, fuel, that's alternative fuel, renewable, renewable fuel now. We're almost at the end. Uh, you see how easy it went really fast. And so, and I was so nervous. <laughs> yeah, and so we're going to um, hope you come back to visit. Tell us how you did at the German TV. And, and uh, it was just great for you to come and visit us. Ich bedanke mich für das Gespräch und für, die, für das Zuhören. And I, what she said, she thanks us for listening and uh, she'll be back, uh, you know, pretty soon. This is our famous Renata Strang that we make reference to all the time. Go to her website, send her an email, you can find her on Facebook. And um, yeah, that's about it. And if you can't find her by yourself, then get a hold of me and I will hook you up with this wonderful lady here. And, and Yoshi, so. Thank you. Thank you, Lilian. You are a good friend. Yeah, nice. Uh, normally we speak in German, you know, now that I know how, but I think we did good. Yeah. Uh-oh. You know what that means? My Skype crashed, and that's the end of it, and I see you next week <laughs> with another um, story from another part of the world. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Thank you.